Welcome back, baseball fans, to the uh, 1969 box here in the 69, 70, 71, 72 carryover league. We are moving into the National League. We're going to go to the National League East and see how the Florida Marlins, Atlanta Braves, New York Mets, Philadelphia Phillies. We're going to start with the expansion team this time. We're going to start with Florida. Um... Florida loses Alan Ashby, Pedro Guerrero, Mickey Hatcher, Jeff Leonard, Craig Reynolds, Rafael Santana. A couple shortstops, a couple outfielders. Dan Schatzetter and Ernie Camacho. Lefty starter, ready reliever, a couple infielders, a couple outfielders. Okay. Uh, Julio Gute is featured uh, in the front of the deck to indicate that uh, this is his last chance. So... Uh, he would be a second baseman against lefties. They really need a shortstop against lefties, don't they, for Santana? Uh, I don't know who they have at second base. They have they have a mess with what they have. Anyway, uh, let's take... Oh, deep farm system, though. Look at that. So, Wade Blazin game and Vic Davileo and Tom Bergmeier are currently in place. But they have a deep, firm system, largely of mediocrity, but it's deep nonetheless. Jose Pagan. Wow, that's a fun card, isn't it? That's 285 with 9 bombs and 274 at-bats. Give you a second, third, and some outfield. That's the versatility they like. So right away, you could do Gote and Pagan, but let's just keep going. Mike Kilkenny, a lefty starter to replace the lefty shot setter. 338, 928 innings. That ain't bad. I think I got my guys right here. So, yeah. Florida, let's think about moving some guys, the Happy Jose's, the, we have Jose Pagan, Jose Martinez, you probably can't get much from him in a deal, Jose Herrera, Rojas, uh, he's not that good right now, is, is, is the problem, and again, Kansas City will bring him up when he hits 300, so he'll just, so I'll turn it well, he's not going to get picked, Roger Repos, not good enough. The Spaceman. How about that? Bill Lee. Uh, way too soon for Bill Lee. He doesn't, isn't effective yet. So not him. Jim Hannon, Pedro Bromas, and yeah. No, I think it's Pagan and Kilkenny. Replacing Shatsetter and one of those right-handed outfielders, Jeff Leonard or Pedro Guerrero. So Florida, that's good. Expansion team. At least they have guys, you know? All right, next up we have... Um, Hotlanta Braves. Boy, they lose Corcoran at 340. They lose Dale Murphy, Steve Nicosia, Jim Rice is gone, Rick Honeycutt, Gustav Mahler, Gene Garber, and Bedrosian. Wow, that's actually a lot of good guys gone. And they have Pat Jarvis, Cleet Boyer, Cepeda, Hyatt, and Mion. Plus the other guys, of course. And that's your farm system, folks. Cecil Upshaw and Milt Pappas. Now, there's a trick to Milt Pappas. Um, Milt Pappas would win a lot of baseball games for the Orioles. So, they're not going to screw this up and bring him in the league. Cecil Upshaw, well, he's a brave. 291. He'll replace Garber. So they got a replacement for Gene Garber, and they need one more guy. So they're halfway there in this box. Next up, the New York Mets. They need to do it. Make that move for the 69 series. Um, in 84, they lose Hubie Brooks, Willie Randolph. Did, those two guys aren't that much. They lose Daryl Strawberry at a lousy year. They lose Doc Gooden and Sid Fernandez, Brent Gaff, Neil Allen, and Doug Corbett. So we talked about how they have Seaver, Kuzma, and McGraw, and they're going to bring in, um, they're going to bring in uh, what's his name from John Matlack. So they need a number four starter, and there is he's sitting right there, Don Cardwell. He could be the number four starter. I believe he was the number four starter for the Mets in '69. He had a three oh two ERA. They don't have Gary Gentry. That would be the preferred player, but Gentry's on Toronto. So I would... Cardwell is good enough. Um, maybe the greedy Mets are thinking, if we're trying to make a World Series run, maybe Cardwell isn't good enough to be the number four starter. They need an upgrade. 
But besides that, you ain't got nothing, because these are already on your team. Garrett, Cranepool, Clendenin, Foy, Harrelson, and McGraw. So, farm system's kind of uh, weak, but that's because the farm system is already in the carryover league. So, Mets get a guy. I need to find one more guy from 69. Uh, another guy to get from 69 would be Ron Taylor from the Orioles. And that would be two guys who won World Series rings for the Mets in 69. Cardwell and Gentry. Excuse me, Cardwell and Taylor. Instead of Gentry. The Phillies. Not quite where they need to be yet. They don't get this thing kicked off until the middle 70s. They just don't have the pieces yet. Um, Turk Farrell, or Dick Farrell, this is his last chance to get in the league. And it's just... Very mediocre there. Good ERA, but a lot of homers and base runners. Um, these Phillies lose Dave Collins, Von Purple Hayes, Mike Schmidt, Jeff Stone, Ozzie Virgil, John Denny, Jeff Reardon. Wow. But they'll be introducing Steve Carlton's 1972 card to the rotation. That's going to be huge. All right, so these, Harmon, Darren Johnson, Dick Selma, Tony Taylor, Horner, and again, Carlton. Not this Carlton. And by the way, this is the Cardinal Carlton. This is why it's like the Cardinals are like, what the hell, man? You're not going to, you got to compensate us for the Steve Carlton BS not playing for the St. Louis. So we had to send Carlton, we had to send Ken Holtzman to the Cardinals to make them happy. So anyway, Philadelphia. Uh, Johnny Briggs looks like he could replace uh, Von Purple Hayes in the outfield. Larry Heisel, not quite there yet. It's close. 266. About 20 homers. That's not too bad. I'm thinking of the Minnesota Heisel. That's a possibility. Jerry Johnson, not really. Mike Ryan, a, no. Decent throwing catcher, but. Felicia's aren't there yet. Actually, I might even like Florida and the Phillies uh, at the bottom of this division for a little bit of time while the Braves and Mets duke it out in the Amer National League East. That's it tonight from the National League East. Hope you're enjoying these 1969 open box videos. We'll see you again next time.